channel. Today I'm going to be sharing with you guys some items I picked up from Sephora, Target, Shein, and Marshall. The first item I did pick up from Sephora is going to be the Jet Set SPF. It comes with different formats of SPF with everyday lotion, bedding mist, and sunscreen for a retail price of $28. I picked this up travel kit because I want to take this with me since I will be traveling. The second item I did pick up was Shani's Retina Routine. I've never personally used it, but I did great hear, but I did hear your reviews about it. I picked up a smaller size with the cleansing serum, retinal reform, and the weightless oil-free moisturizer. The next few items that I did pick up were some House of Lashes with Patrick Top. I picked up It's a Look and I Mean. These were actually on sale. I'm not sure if they're still currently on sale. They were about $14 each. The next item that I did pick up was a green Dior liquid eyeliner. I've been looking for colored eyeliners for the longest and I have not been able to find any that are bright enough. This I believe was about $30. This kind of wraps everything from Sephora. But now I'm going to be moving out on some of the things I did pick up from Target. Target has some really great deals right now and they partnered with Levi. They are putting out a lot of cute things. If you guys haven't checked them out, I definitely recommend. The first pair of pants are not from the Levi collection, however, but they are some straight crop um, pants. They're from A New Day. Yes, this would be the finish to the pants. They are super cute and they actually fit really great. It's about $20. This I'll more than likely be wearing with like a crop top. I'll show you guys in another video when I, once I do put all of these together and I do pair them with a lot of the things that I did purchase today and with some things that I do have here in my closet at home. The next pair of pants that I did pick up from Target were a vintage straight denim cut from Universal Thread. These were about $29.99, so about $30. The finish does come like this. These came a little smaller, so they are more snug here at the waist. I don't like my pants too, too snug, but I did like how it looked, so I am going to still keep it. I also did pick up skinny jeans from the Levi collection. These came out to $25. Okay, and this wraps up Target. Moving on to the things that I did pick up from Shein. Shein is less than expensive. I would actually recommend shopping at Shein if you are looking to try anything new, any new trends that right now, of course, can be expensive if you do visit more of your higher end stores. And if you're not too sure if you're going to like that style, I would recommend for you to shop at Shein. This, for example, is one of the tops that I really, really, really like. This top would go perfect for the beach underneath your bathing suit. Oh, it's really sheer. I'll put all the price points on the description. I also did pick up this crop top from Shein. Most of these crop tops that I do have here that I'm going to show you guys are all less than $10, maybe even less than $8, some were $5. They were really cheap. This, I believe, is still on the site and you can still purchase it. Most of the things do sell out pretty quickly. This crop top that I did pick up, I bought $4 as well. Another top, this one's more silky. It's super soft. Another crop top that I did pick up from Shein. It's super cute. It has a band here at the bottom. This I did pick up from a size medium. This one's really just all polyester, but the scrunch up on the sides. If you don't like any of the scrunch, then they do have a lot of different options available for you guys on there. The next item that I did pick up was just a regular t-shirt. It's so soft. The next item I did pick I did pick up was a collared rib top. It's about 95% polyester and 5% spandex, so it does stretch. Next one is a sleeveless bodysuit. This one's 90% nylon and 10% spandex. The next one is this skirt. It was 
maybe like $14, nothing too crazy. It has a zipper on the side with a cup. I feel like this would be a great piece for spring. The next item that I did pick up from Shein is a set. It's really soft, really comfortable. It is a cardigan with some wide leg pants. It was one size, so this one doesn't actually come in sizes. At the waist, it is relatively smaller. But the pants area is wide leg. It's ribbed as well. And we'll see all cotton, of course, with this aside from the stamex at the top. The next set that I did purchase is going to be from Katie's 13 years. I wanted to purchase both, but they sold out so fast I needed to wait for the restock. I did purchase a size small in this one. The tag's really soft. So excited to put these on me. The last store is from Marshalls. The first item was an ice purple uh, white Adidas cap. That was originally $17, but I did purchase it for $12.99. It does have an adjustable strap in the back. Just some socks. The next item was also a top. It's super soft. It came out to $9.99. I wish they had more because I would probably purchase more of the same top. Which also felt like went perfect, of course, with these pants that are also wide leg. This is a size small and was originally $28, but I picked it up for $19.99. It's super cute for the summer, spring, and would also go great with this top right here. Last but not least, of course, was this um, denim dress with a zipper and a belt and was originally $25 and I picked it up for it's $19.99. This I picked up in a size large, the only one that I found to be exact. So it does have a belt so you can adjust it at the waist. But this does wrap everything that I did pick up today. Please don't forget to like, share, and subscribe to my channel. Thank you so much for watching.